yeah hi friend uh you have seen that for past in past week i haven't been active to my channel so some question has been piled up so today i am going to uh, answer all the, all the questions so i felt that okay since there are lots of questions so if it be a commentative way mean where i can uh, reply all those thing in a videos also then it would be fine so let's continue so in this video i will be answering all the question which has been commented by my subscriber friend family members whatever you can say uh, and i could not able to reply them in the past 3 4 days so let's continue our first question has been asked by himanshu gupta uh, he said that i have seen your accenture videos as well so tcs or accenture which one is should i choose as an mba graduate working in in airtel see a company to choose it's it's totally your choice I mean accenture is also a very good company as well as tcs so both are pretty good company so it's your choice to choose any of the two company both are very good but for fresher for less experience which who want growth in their career i always says that go for accenture because the high can growth with accenture are pretty good compared to tcs or other company so my suggestion will would be uh, you can go for accenture so himanshu i have replied you uh, next question asked by amit amit kumar ne question pucha are yaar video banana ho shant jagah mein main kare jahan balak balak na ho <laughs> see amit i i am not a professional youtuber I mean और मेरा चैनल में ऐसा भी नहीं है कि मैं दस कट करता हूँ उसके बाद मैं ये वीडियो बनाता हूँ तो हाँ मैं आपका सेशन को ध्यान में रखूँगा नेक्स्ट टाइम मैं जनरली ट्राई करता हूँ कि कम से कम आवाज़ हो बट सिंस मैं एक प्रोफेशनल यूट्यूबर नहीं हूँ सो इसके कारण आपको बैकग्राउंड में मेरे घर के बच्चों का या बाहर के बच्चों का आवाज़ आ सुन सुना जा सकता है पर मैं ट्राई करूँगा आप खुद को इम्प्रूव करने का ओके लेट्स मूव ऑन सो अनदर क्वेश्चन आक्स बाय श्रीनिवास दी दिमित्री दिमसिति प्लीज श्रीनिवास सॉरी फॉर दिस यू नेम इज दिमसिति दिमसिति आई प्रोनाउंस रॉन्गली एट फर्स्ट सो ही ही सेड डेट हाय सर आई जॉइन इन अ कंपनी लास्ट मंथ एंड आई रिजाइन आफ्टर एट डेज एंड आई गॉट अनदर फ्रॉम अनदर कंपनी अदर ऑफ फ्रॉम अनदर कंपनी the previous man uh, company give me the salary of 8 days so the pf account also create but i don't want to disclose any details regarding this 8 days employed to my new company i am joining as fresher will the pf account created any problem or i don't think so it will create any problem mean if you want to uh, check your check your case you, you just simply go to the linkedin I mean maine ye bahut baar dekha hai ki पीपल गेट फ्रस्ट्रेटेड प्लेस पीपल गेट वट टू सेवर डर डर जाते हैं कि वॉट विल हैपन सी वो ये केस आपका बन सकता था अगर आप लोग बिना बोले उन्हें दौ भाग जाते भागे होंगे या कुछ तो इट्स बेटर टू से मीन गिव अ हिंट टू द एच आर डेट ओके आई हैव वर्क इन अ कंपनी फॉर सर्टन टाइम बट Uh, for for a week, but I did not like the company culture. Hence, I move on. I mean, ये hint दे देना better है, but I don't think it will cause any problem, since you don't have any experience. So, so इसके लिए वो gap में भी नहीं जोड़ाएंगे और आपका experience भी उतना hamper नहीं होगा. So I don't think it will cause much problem. Okay, I'm uh, going to my next question. Uh, I think this is the first video where I am pausing. So. <laughs> So the next question is that hi sir i have completed all my interviews round and i got this mail from accenture last week after that no update from accenture so he did not okay in below section he said that congratulation you have cleared all of your interview round you are one step for being part of the diverse team of innovation we will very okay see once you clear all your round and update all your documents in the accenture portals if you are experienced like for my case uh, when i 
cleared all my interview role and I got this mail. Then I have to submit my document. I submitted all, all those things and my HR went. After that, for two weeks, no update. <laughs> yeah, for I would say 10 working days, I did not get any update and suddenly uh, I got I, I got that, okay, you have been selected. And again, after that also for, for four to five days, I did not get any update. So in between that, what they do, they validate your document at whether it's a correct document or not. And if everything they find it suitable, then only they will give an offer. So same for you, wait for some days. For me, it's what more than two weeks. So wait for two weeks and if in, in and check your status in Accenture portal, job portals. So if you, and I, I, I would, I would suggest that don't, uh, be dependent on this job I mean try to give other interview also but for your case look bright so wait for two weeks and then go with the flow okay the next question asked by Pooja Kumari uh, she said sir as a fresher should I join IBM or not uh, I have a cognizant offer 4.1 data warehouse domain and IBM 4.25 See, both the company are pretty good. I mean, if you ask me that whether I, I would join uh, Cognizant, I would say yes. I might join. If you said I would join IBM, I would say yes. So both are pretty good company to start your career. I mean, they will give you a good launch pack to your career. So you can join any of those. Now, uh, regarding this, I mean, I always suggest, I mean, actually that thing happened with me that I got an offer. I mean, when I was fresher, I got an offer from Accenture and I waited, waited. And in between that, I did not give any interviews. I mean, I mean actually 10, 10 years back, uh, this kind of trend wasn't there. So, and then suddenly uh, in March, I realized that I am not getting any offer from Accenture. And then I joined a very small company. So this thing happened. Uh, try to... Uh, always select a company which give you a joining letter, a joining dates, and then decide. I mean, unless you get a joining dates from a IBM, uh, don't uh, be dependent on them. If Cognizant give you a joining date earlier, then you can. But if if IBM also provide you a joining date before the joining date of Cognizant, I mean. I mean, during the time, during the joining date of Cognizant, if you get to know that, okay, when you would be going to join IBM, I would say at that case, uh, go for IBM. But if till that time IBM don't give any joining date, I would say I, you can select Cognizant. It's not that you can't, you can, but so at that time, at that time, think, take the decision. I'll, so unless IBM, uh, don't provide you a joining date, uh, don't reject Cognizant offer. Okay, the next question has been asked by Jatin Varma. Hi sir, in EY uh, is starting package of a graduate. Uh, hi sir, in EY what is the starting pack package of a graduate and what kind of work they allocate? Uh, they Are they also higher company secretary? So first of all, uh, starting package is around 4 lakhs. 3.8 to 4 I don't know the exact amount but something in that range second thing what kind of work they allocate see uh, for fresh uh, most of the MNCs goes goes through the training and EY also done does that so for, for for a few months two to three months they will give you the training and based on your performance of your training they will allocate your work and third question are they higher company secretary I think yes every company has uh, I would say secretary may or may not be but they can be an HR or they can be a, a person from a back office who, 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 who could do the back office kind of thing so similar kind of jobs are there but I am not 100% sure about the secretary because in IBM also I did not find any secretary for any managers or any director so, uh, so that's it so he so this is so going to the next question uh, it's chitty wall yeah hi chitty wall so hi bro i have been selected for gen pack a uh, congratulation i have three years gap okay uh, gen pack asked me to provide the bank statement from a previous company my account was not active for from 
three years on behalf of the statement what document should i provide please suggest so chitty mean uh, similar case was with me also i mean six year back when i joined one company and that account uh, wasn't active so what i did i mean one account was in dormant state so i went there talked to the manager and then i have to submit a kyc to the bank and that bank become active second thing uh, i have one another a company where uh, i literally forgot everything I mean the account name and everything and the uh, it, it it was a salary account so it was totally closed and i don't have that mobile number also so what i did i used to get the monthly statement online statement so i have shown that and that work for me I mean i am working in tcs with that bgv so you you can do that I mean first thing you can do that okay, you can go to the bank and uh, fill one form to make your account active second thing you can do if you have the monthly statement I mean if you get if you getting a mail uh, from that bank for your monthly statement then you can show that I mean i have i have done this two thing and this to work for me so you can also do this thing okay going to the next person it's deepika aparna hi sir i am from andhra pradesh i have received recently placed in tcs smart hiring for cbo stream okay i got an ilp training location at bhubaneswar odisha and they set virtual onboarding this work from home will continue this entire year or not because my parents don't want me to go to bhubaneswar Uh, give me some suggestion see uh, i mean earlier time also training used to be on some place and then based on your project allocation you would be allocated on the different places so same thing would happen here also and as far i know it depend upon projects to projects uh, i mean whether they will continue the work from home culture or not like for my case i have been offered work from home till this december and and after that also i do not get any news to return to the office but for few others they have got so it totally depend upon the projects uh, whether you will be working from home or working from office and regarding training also I mean most uh, most of the thing are on are virtual so for your case also it might be virtual till this end and after this after december you, you will get notified what would be happen so wait for some time right so the next question asks by uh, saurav kumar okay he said that i have offer from infosys of x lakh and cognizant of x plus 2 lakh experience 3.8 which one should i join see cognizant and an infosys i would say both are are totally on the same level position and in between these two my personal choice would be i i think it totally depend upon you me <laughs> i have went work with infosys and my uh, i would say with cities also i have seen the people have worked there and my friends also work on both the companies and they also says that it's a totally similar company so if you're getting 2 lakhs more in cognizant so i would I, i i can i i can say that you can choose cognizant because it's giving you higher salary second thing is that high key hiking cognizant is also pretty good third they give you variables also so you can choose cognizant in in between these two so going to third person and this would be the last answer for now I mean i will create another video series part 2 where i will continue giving the other other, other answer of the comment so this is this has been asked by mohini gavai okay so hi mohini so hello sir i got selected in accenture but they asked me to give form 16 but i don't have recently and they kept my candidature on hold so my candidature will be cancel after some time or what will happen see if they ask you to give form 16 uh mean for my case also they ask similar thing so i said that i don't have in my, in my previous company so first they ask for form 16 if you don't have, have then they will ask for the for, for the pf account 
and if you do, if, if your company don't have a pf account the third thing they will ask is the bank statement so for my case also uh, i mean i when i was working on a startup they don't have the uh, pf account or the, or the, the forms I mean so i and they don't have any site from where i can download the form 16 so i said clearly that hey i, I don't have form 16 i don't have pf account for that for that company yeah i have my bank statement i can provide you that i can show you that online so i have shown that and i got selected i mean i got joins jo joining letters from the accenture so you can also do that thing you can send mail that hey i have a brother hey, hey sir hi sir i don't have my form 16 with me if you have your pf account you can say that i can provide you the pf statement of the company else you can say that i can provide uh, my salary statement for this so these were the few questions which i have uh, answered till now i will continuing the, i will continue this uh, video session uh, with lots of more questions and answers so if you like my video then press the like button subscribe my channel and watch the other video also so thank you and bye bye